and welcome to Greg's Channel 1. I am Greg and this is Channel 1. Now, in this video today, it is the day of Survivor Series. So the WWE are doing Survivor Series in Toronto, Canada. Because it's just following up from NXT TakeOver Toronto. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to dive right in, purely because I haven't got too much time to have as much fun as I like. So, I'm going to put them in, I've put all the matches in order, of how I, what order I think they're going to go in. I'm going to explain why I think they're going to go in that way. Um, I've done an approved, where it says approved, on the winners. So, let's get this started. The first match will be, as I've shown, the Cruiserweight. Championship match between V. Brian Kendrick and Kalisto. If Kalisto wins, all of the cruiserweights and the title go to SmackDown. Now, this is what I think is going to happen. I think it's going to be a clear win for SmackDown Live. They're going to win this relatively well. Um, all of the cruiserweights are going to go to SmackDown Live purely because if my sources are correct, which normally ketchup and barbecue are, but Ha ha ha, never mind. Uh, terrible joke, terrible joke. Um, with that, um, I think, from what I've heard, there's going to be a show on Tuesday related to the Cruiserweights, to give the Cruiserweights more focus. So, if that is true, then logic suggests that SmackDown should win this. So Kalista wins, and you can still have that show then, because it can then be SmackDown Live, Cruiserweight show, talking smack, bada boom. You know what I'm saying. I'm the realest guy in my room. Wait, I'm the only guy. Never mind. So, yes, I think Kalisto's going to win. Kalisto's probably going to hit him with one Selena Del... Two, one or two Selena, Selena Del Sols. And that'll be it. Kind of thing. I think Kendrick will put on a real, real good aggressive match. And then you'll have two of uh, Kalisto's finishers to end the match. You know, because one's not enough to pin Kendrick, so a second one finishes him off. I then think this match will come up next. The women's five side. Now, as you can see, I think that the Team Raw are going to win. I know they did a lot of infighting, but I think that, that that's just because they want to try and stay... Oh, Team Raw can't get along. Team Raw are going to lose. Ha 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 ha. Ha 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 ha. Bloody bloody crappy crap. But I think what's going to basically happen is you're going to have Alexa and Becky versus the entire Team Raw, and then you'll have what you'll. I think what they'll do is they'll have Becky be the last woman standing for SmackDown Live, and she will take out maybe. Nia, uh, Sasha, and probably Charlotte. Leave Bailey to be the one that beats her at the end. So then you've got a face winning at the end kind of thing. Because it's face versus face, that kind of thing at the end. Foxy will be the first one to go for the Raw. Raw will probably bite the dust with, Raw, with Foxy straight away. Fox will go out first, and then... Smackdown Live will get steamrolled, Carmella will get rolled up, Nikki will get beaten, Naomi probably go out first for Team Smackdown, probably. Um, Alexa Bliss going out right at the very end, just before Becky has to take on Charlotte and Bailey. Bailey, you know, Charlotte can't work with Bailey, so gets herself rolled up and beaten, or something like that, and Bailey takes the win. Something like that. That's what I'm kind of thinking then I think it'll be this match The Miz versus Sami Zayn now it's for the IC belt but what I think is going to happen is Miz is going to lose but he's not going to lose the belt because of the fact that he got his belt back through nefarious means Miz is going to you know go down he's going to look like he's about to beat Sami Zayn Ziggler comes down because, you know, it looks like Maurice is going to get involved. Ziggler slides in. Zigzag. Ref sees him. D 
DQ. DQ finish. So Miz gets to keep the title. Sami Zayn still theoretically gets the win. Um, Dolph can then beat up. Beat him up then. Something like that. Um, yeah. Simple as that. That's kind of what I'm thinking. Dolph beats up Miz. And then you can have Sami Zayn. You know, Sam Raw. You know, Dolph Ziggler screw me out of my belt. And you can have Daniel Bryan come out and say, if you want another shot, come and join Team Blue. To which Sami Zayn, you can then transition Sami Zayn from Raw to SmackDown. That's what I'm thinking. You then got the tag team match. Yay! Look at all those people. SmackDown's going to win. American Alpha are going to be the team that's left standing. Uh, you'll probably have... Probably Breezango go out first. Then the Usos. Then you'll have Hype Bros go. So at that point you've got practically all of Team Raw versus American Alpha and the tag team champs. Um, Shining Stars drop out. Sh Cesaro and Sheamus can't get on so they fall out. So you then got Gallows and Anson, Enzo and Cass, New Day, Heath Slater and Rhino get rolled up, you know, some kind of screwy finish to get rid of them. And then American Alpha gets rid of everyone else. Therefore cementing that American Alpha are a powerful team. Nice and simple. I'm rolling through these today. Ay ay ay. Then the match that I'm really not overly looking forward to. Although I was quite impressed with the way that they built it on one man's side. Brock Lesnar versus Goldberg. Brock Lesnar is my approved choice. What I think will happen is Goldberg will put up a pretty good fight. You know, Heyman will get involved somehow through shenanigans. Uh, Brock Lesnar will. Be, you know, get a pin on Goldberg and then just keep battering the hell out of him. Shane comes out because I don't think Shane's going to make it to the final, to the big event. Shane comes down because, you know, this is, you know, kind of showing up exactly what happened with Randy Orton where Randy Orton was battered and bruised and bleeding and everything. So Shane comes out and he's like, what the hell are you doing? Brock, just get off him, get off him. You know, stop it. Stop being a jackass. Brock Lesnar takes exception to this, beats the crap out of Shane. You know, Shane kind of get, screws Team SmackDown. Trying to be a commissioner, kind of trying to be an authority figure. So he gets his ass kicked, you know, a couple of F5s. Uh, maybe a couple of suplexes and you just got Shane flat out dead to the world. <laughs> Which then brings me on to the final match of the night, which will be... Ba -da -ba! I think Team SmackDown are going to win. Shane is out. I think Undertaker shows up. Undertaker or John Cena. Doo -doo -doo. One of those two will show up. Shane will get battered to hell by Lesnar. And you'll have Daniel Bryan going... Oh my god, what am I meant to do? Uh, you know, we're already a man down, we're screwed. Um, so you've got it, and he's, he gets a phone call. And it, you know, he, it's from John Cena or someone. You know, it's either from Cena or Undertaker just saying, you know, and he, you know, Daniel Bryan can be like, you can make it. Well, we're up next. Hang up, cut to the match. Have Raw kind of, you know, have Kevin Owens and Jericho kind of like gloating like, eh, 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 you're only four, we are five, na 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 na. Because, you know, they, they do that kind of stuff quite funny and quite well. And then you bring out, if it's Undertaker, you know, you've got everyone, you know, you've got SmackDown looking like, okay, we're going to have to fight our way through this. You just hear, gong, gong, lights go out. Lights come up, and you know, 
maybe have Kevin Owens takes the he bites the first pin. Kevin Owens is flat out. Undertaker's, you know, kind of tombstoned him kind of thing. One, two, three. And you can build it up that way. Something like that. That's what I'm thinking. Uh, other than that, I think SmackDown will win. Something like that. If it's John Cena, he comes down, saves the day. La, da, 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 da. Happy days. Anyway, um, I'm going to try and get this up as quick as possible. Because it's on tonight. Ah, so much to do. Uh, anyway, if you enjoyed the video, give me a thumbs up. Subscribe here or here. Um, let me know your opinions, if you've got time, in the comment section below. See you later, guys.